Heavy machine guns and aircraft strafing runs can suppress and pin troops, preventing them from advancing. These weapons include the German MG-42 and the Soviet Maxim heavy machine guns. When suppressed, the squad will go to a prone position to minimize their profile. They will be protected, reasonably but not for long. If your squads are no longer under fire, the suppressed troops will eventually come out of suppression and be ready for full combat. Also, it is very important to note that suppressed squads make it far easier for other squads nearby to be suppressed. Machine guns can cover large areas, so keep your squads reasonably spread out. A single machine gun can suppress many infantry squads. If you allow your suppressed squads to stay suppressed for too long, they will become pinned. Pinned squads will not be able to move, fire or capture points. But unless you can respond quickly, either by killing the enemy machine gun with another squad or blocking their line of sight with smoke to break contact, the best course of action is to fall back or retreat. Retreating is not an admission of failure. It is a way to keep your highly trained and veteran troops alive. Retreating squads will take the shortest path back to headquarters. And because they are moving quickly, they are far harder to hit. Squads reduced in strength can be quickly reinforced at the headquarters and sent back into battle. <laughs>